Hello, welcome to day Canon Fella 2 on the Amiga and the proper <coughs> beaker as well. So, if you hear any, like, yeah, so we're gonna <coughs> fire it up straight away. So, if you hear disc noises, because we've got three disc drives and it's just gonna, it's gonna uh, 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 and grind away, but uh, like this. basically, yeah, it's want to do this on the proper hardware as well because I don't think Canon Fella 2 gets the kind of showing that. The other one does because I mean you've got the 3DO version, you've got the Mega Drive and Snares version, you've got like the Game Boy version, which sucks. Then you've got the PC version, then you've got the 3DO, then you've got the. I'm pretty sure you just mentioned the 3DO. Did I? Well, I think it's I so mentioned good everything. that it needs to be mentioned twice. Exactly, it's all like loads of mentions. <clears> so. <throat> A bit concerned that this may be a little bit black screen every so often. Oh, yeah, um, loading times. Oh, there'll be killers. Um, there'll be slice. There's a lot of loading in this, and it takes a long time to play. Long, long. For how short it is, pop that over there for me, please. You say it's short. Well, you see, this is the thing with Cannon Fodder 2, right? You had Cannon Fodder, which flew through and was really, really big. The Elgan title screen. Oh, I'm dying. Fuck another Amiga. <laughs> Boy, a million tons. Yeah, well that one's got an 8 meg RAM bought in and I'm working on things. Oh, whoa, it's only ever been this much fun once before with a funky backbeat. Um, but I'm going to skip by this a little bit straight away because it's the generic guff. But no, um, so kind of follow 2, I don't think got the recognition that kind of I wouldn't say deserve. Personally, it's, I don't think it's as good as the first one. Mm. But, I'll be showing why. Because the first one just... It was like a smooth sail into the into the abyss. I want disc 2. I don't need to worry about that. Because disc 2 is already in. It's the joy of having external drives for this rig. Didn't even get on the... Like it would load it in the title screen and then I assume the second disc. Well that's Amiga for you, you, know, you normally get your intro set up and then pow straight in with the uh, the second disc. Alien Breed was a pain in the ass for that mm. and Body Blows was an even bigger pain in the ass for that. Seeing as a copy of Body Blows I got two fucking copies as well. Give boot disc plus disc two, three and I think four and I need a fucking disc one. Right. Shuts so, up with this instantly. There ain't no grassy knoll. This ain't no grassy knoll. This is alien land. Big building in the background there. This? Yeah. Uh, a big dong building with a little penis. Spurty bit. Pair of nuts. A new okay. helmet. So we're going for it now. <coughs> Let's do and it. Instantly. Anybody who hasn't played Cannon Fodder 2 before. We'll see how much of a, a smash in the nuts this is because this remember game does Cannon not Fodder, fuck around. You just remember Cannon Fodder's start off level. It's jewels and jobs and three dudes in a circular map, basically. Yeah, and it kind of shows you you've got what you need to do, and then you're, you're moving on. Not too you're bad. You're moving on up, moving on out. Time to break free. Nothing can stop me. This is how it begins. Where you get ruined instantly. It's just, it's like constant loading, but I mean when it's loading everything into the RAM and then on to the setup, yeah. it's a pain in the ass, especially seeing as um, the RAM's on a little card in the back. <sighs> Personal computers at this time were so simpler, so much simpler, and it was it's just so much nicer, I think. Right, but it's like, well, one, no. two, three, done. Yeah, okay. you've got Kickstart. So a kickstart is, I mean, as kick I was start, messing uh -huh. around with a little, that other Amiga there, there's kickstart too. The tiny little chip. Um, then you've got all your graphics chips and things like that. I mean, fair enough. This is basically on the level of like a Mega Drive, but it uses a Motorola 68K as well as that. Um, unlike my Amiga 600, which has been accelerated to fuck. It has pimped, pimped oh, that pimped, shit. pimped a bit, that. Right, so. We'll load it in eventually. Let's go. And instantly. Dude. Instantly. Dudes. It's like this one does not dick around. Yeah, like oh, they're bleeding, man. They're bleeding. Oh, God. There's two of them bleeding. But it's like this, this just doesn't dick around. Die already? 
Move closer! He's too oh, far why away! Why fucking shoot me? There you go! Oh, oh put him out of the misery. Poor man. Poor man. That was the best shooting ever. Wait, I'm aiming at him! <laughs> Sorry, sir. I'm trying my best. Was it my fault? The instant, right? So for all that loading time there, I mean... Ah, I've just noticed something quite cunning about that. What? The first level is in the shape of a two. So it is. Dun, dun, dun. Ah, I see what you did there. Aye. I'll let, you, I'll let them off for that. That was quite Probably clever. a giant You take fucking ass. <clears throat> Mission one, heroes, jewels. I'll tell you what they did think about Jobs. with this one, though. They didn't put a insert disc three one on the first cannon fodder at this area. Yeah. So I just sat with black screen for twenty minutes, thinking, "What the fuck?" Staring at you, what's going on? Aye. Uh, and then you were like, "Crying, cha -cha 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 -cha. And then you went on. Ah. So I mean, on the first one, that would have been a disc one to get up to the actual gameplay. Um, disc two to play, and then disc three to load in a screen, and then drop back to disc two to load in the next level, then disc three to load in the happiness and the unhappiness. More dudes. Lots of dudes. So I mean, initially, this just seems, well to be fair, this looks slow as fuck this compared ah. to like, the other machines version because it's a slow walk over the alien hill and uh, into death. The alien field. I'm fearing because this, this, it's, it's running all right, like, whoops, wrong button. Oh. That's better. We're running into the kind of alien fields and we're basically in Earth at the minute, but as soon as this all kind of... Maybe a bit stupid, more I hate having to, to explain all about this whole alien bollocks. Well, you'll see. You'll see, because we'll get right, there. I haven't really explained that bit yet. Well, yeah, basically, Cannon Follow 1 was just you against an army, then Cannon Follow 2 was you against an army, then the UFOs come in and take you and stuff like that. And then Cannon Follow 3 was just take the game, put it in a toilet bowl, shit on it, and don't flush. For days. I'm going to go and soggy in. Nugget to justice. <laughs> Fucking detest Cannon Follow 3. What That's a bag of shit. I was so excited. It was like a 3D one. Yeah. The, 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 was it 2.5D? Wait, it's got fucking screen sway for when you're walking. And I'm sorry, top down with screen sway as you're what? jogging along. What? And we're ready to what? go with the next level. There we go. Let's see, we'll do it right now. Instead of like going extreme close up. Let's do this. Where are I? I'm down at the Got side. It. See, initially with it being single screen, I'm alright with single screen setups, but I mean, you're looking. I'm paused, there's mines here. Oh, oh. Like these wait. nipples. Wait, they might be. But, wait, I'm shooting them and nothing's happening, so we're gonna pray to, pray to the, the god of please don't kill me when we walk over them. Boy! Now we're good. So, see this one? It's like literally first one gets you into the controls, but of course anybody who's played Cannon Fodder 2 buys it off the back of playing Cannon Fodder 1. And you can't shoot through these. Over goes a grenade. Oh, boy. Oh, uh, wiped them. How did he survive? Because he used flanginium. There we go. Ah, oh, shit. No get back in there, fool. <laughs> so, that, you know what? That went way more, way more smoother than the last time you actually did this, where you walked around the corner and you just got hosed. It took like half like, an hour to do it. It's like, fuck, what? It's just... It's impressive. This ain't Pismo Beach. This one's the one where you got properly spanked. Though. Well, you know, because I mean, we'll play everything before like we record so that we know the gist of what we're doing. Yeah, but you got properly but spanked. I played this to test it because I always test the Amiga games that I get straight away. Because there's generally a couple of them that just. Launches. See, in the come, they're flying in instantly, ready to get. Nah, for the wrecking. Because, fucking hell, he's rocky and they're firing, like, really quickly. Oh, we lost a guy. Oh, no. There goes Joe. Jobs. Ah, oh, Jobs is gone. He's down, Jobs man, he's down. down. There's more fucking people coming. Scared to blow up these grenades. He's See, smart. he's waiting, he's sneaking. The he's fucking AI been... was tweaked on this one. Fuck. Doesn't help that I'm trying to use, like, oh. Ah oh, no, there goes Stu! 
I'm trying to use a box instead of like a mouse mat setup and it's creasing while I'm going. But it's like literally it just turns into fucking predator here. Firing into the abyss. Oh, oh you gotta hook the ball. <coughs> Granada! Granada! Is that actually another dude there? Is it? See, he's firing just for the hell of it, and I can't reach this guy. So, how am I supposed to get to him? Throw when a grenade? Because apparently you've got like giant fucking throwing capabilities. Oh, yeah, you've got to kind of throw, like, jeez. There goes Jules. Jules is down. It's just JL. Oh, duh. People just get wiped out and picked off as you're going straight away. It's war. War is just, just hell. War is hell. <laughs> I'm not going to go into the whole Metal Gear Solid speech. Click, click, click. And we're back loading. So for the amount of time you actually are playing, Phase three. you're loading more Take than anything else. Yours. That's what I'm about to say, that rocket. Here we go. Three soldiers you must. Three soldiers you must. Ah, goodbye, Ace. You are a worthy adversary. Goodbye, Ace Rimmer. You are a worthy adversary. Oh shit! No, he took out Audrey. I'm dead, man. I'm dead. <laughs> I was like, instant. I was playing the first cannon fire the other day. No oh, shit, there goes another guy. And just... Oh, it's just Johnny left. You've got this, Johnny. I'm concerned about... Fucking hell, people are just exploding. It, it's like the um, the Michael Bay version of cannon fodder. There's just add more explosions. Explosiones. It's like literally all Well, luckily they already blew the boob top off it, so you didn't have to worry about anything flying into your face. I'm concerned that some guy's just gonna walk out and cane us, though, instantly. I would have loved it if he'd shot that fucking box. <laughs> Bro, just wipe you out instantly. I know. I'm doing better already because generally I've got to do a mission uh, a try again. Johnny? At least two or three Johnny. times by now. Kicks my ass. Everybody's just gonna be private. Nobody's gonna actually get Oh, no one's gonna get promoted in this game. Ah, like, oh, see, it's just more of a short through for, you know, what oh, this is oh, like. But it's safe. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Everybody <laughs> but Johnny. <laughs> oh, that's what I just said, lost in service. Everyone. See, they didn't even get fucking promoted. Look at it, man. So how many such Six people were lost. Yeah, straight off the bat. Straight off the bat, and here we go. Heroes in service. Johnny! I'm not even gonna get a hero here. Oh well. Probably not. Nah, it's just gonna load in the next level. I don't even think... It's like, it's like they didn't even bother putting in the heroes set up purposefully for that reason. Six people? My god. But according to that, Jules and Jobs did get promoted. Yeah, they did. But, here <laughs> we go then. Johnny's promoted now, though. Well, you got Bill and Cam. This is this is the thing. It starts you where you're kind of like more of a Twitch style shooting, and then, then, is all I say to this. Then it becomes insanity. I want to kill somebody. It's not even a helicopter coming in. I mean, we've got like this compound fracture, right? I like the way all these are named on weird little kind of players on things. Mm. I mean, players on this. Well, no, there's um, I think there's a website called World of Stewart or World of Stew, where it's the guy who thingied this, programmed some of this, and did like the mission rankings and things like that. And it just kind of what it does is it explains why he named them. Getting a bit worried now. It's phase one of four. She's getting longer and longer. See, I know we'll get the alien ship at least, but. Jesus. Man, it fucking takes so long to load in. It's like, ah! Now go. 
Let's do this. 36 recruits remaining. Instantly. Fucking round the corner. You know shit. Like, yeah. Literally instantly. Dudes. Oh, there you go. One building down. Two buildings, two buildings down. down. About very close to wiping out your entire team of dudes. Well, I'm not going to complain that I'm going, I'm going for these girl nerds. Pick the granny up. They're coming for you, Jeeves. You really should have a, a character named Jeeves. I think someone's going to get it. But it's... it's it is... Oh, oh, he Do you know what gets door. us? And then the door walked out on him. <laughs> Don't go. Walk out the door. Don't Just turn, turn around, around now. Before it hits you. You're in the forehead. <laughs> See, I, like I was saying just before, I was playing the original Canfora and I got the, um, it's the first Skidoo level. Oh, the Skidoo level, level is yeah. fucking amazing. And there's a house right in front of you when you start. I thought, right, I'll take one guy, took one guy, bombed the house, fuck me, the roof went back and landed on the rest <laughs> of my team. And I was like, no, <sighs> oh, he just got decimated. I think that was a couple of mines there. Hey! hey. <laughs> I was afraid that that shit was. Like, the mine's blown up everywhere. And like, so I'm like, is there one last guy left? Are we gonna actually walk into a mine and wipe out my team? I know. Are we gonna get fucked? I think the best one on the kind of Water One one was when you had the uh, the skidoo and you went, right, I've totally got this. Went for the ramp, went past the ramp and just straight to <laughs> the fucking lake. You're like, Whoosh. I yeah. don't have this. It, it's it's with it being mouse control, let me talk this wrong. The, the, the Amiga is always going to be like one of my favourite machines. Uh, I've got a weird taste for consoles that I like playing on and computers I like playing on. Run, you fools! They're shooting at me! I can't move the mouse button! No! You only lost one dude. Well, I'm just going to rush him. Two dudes down! Just ah. swish and swipe! Whew. Throw a grenade! I oh, know you don't I haven't got a grenade, that's the problem. No! Oh, oh, you, you got more oh, fucker! <laughs> you see what I mean? It's like <laughs> Slam! <laughs> Slam your balls in a door. Oh. Say but it's like rockets. I know when it's my fault. Johnny! Johnny! Oh, I suggest you take one dude, right? You can't! That's the problem, you can't just take one dude, because, like, these rocket guys kick your ass. Total definition of running gun. He's behind the tree and I can't get one. You've got this one guy Captain again. Rockets has got it. You win! Let's do this, Eric! Eric's... Eric's victorious! <laughs> Eric's the boss! And no, he didn't get a door in the face like Johnny. But... <laughs> Dipper Dopper! You see, it's just... It's so... It's much more action-based than the first one. The first one had quite a bit of... Kind of... When they investigated Johnny's death, you could say that the case was closed. <laughs> You're an idiot. Like a doorway on his face. Yes, like a doorway on his face. See, generally I'm uh, right here, but somebody's down! Oh, it's Eric! No, it's not. You just. Son of a bitch, I needed those. You needed those to live. I need those grenades to actually get by. I'm gonna grab these ones before this guy caps us. Shit, oh. there goes another guy. Shh. Retreat! Retreating's just terrifying, and somebody's. Someone's not doing well. I can see him up top. I think that's one of your dude. Oh, I hope not! Oh no, it's one of those. And now I can't fuck it Run! up. <laughs> like literally, I can't fuck anything up or blow any boxes of grenades up. 
Rush it. Son of a bitch! Queef! Fuck! Oh, you blew yourself up. I did. I need a different thing to have this mouse on. I need something seriously, like, flat. Um, that isn't. Kind of thing. I'm going to try it this side. It's so hard. <laughs> can you pour me another drink? I can pour thee another drink. Thank you. Fairest brotherino. Let's try this full screen. That's better. I mean, it's like a, this one. The Amiga was much more like pushed towards the likes of point and click adventures, so it's like a lot of mouse based kind of control schemes, which again isn't. It's not bad because I like the this setup. Yeah. I mean, I've been playing things like. Um, well, I started playing Lure of the Temptress because you know what I'm like for me puzzle games, me, what do you call it, um, adventures, point clicks and things like that. Yeah, because no, you're, are... like, you're like, you know, Broken Sword, um, was it, oh, was it Monkey Island. Yeah, bro yeah, they're like some of the best games like ever written and made. I mean, this is the thing. I played through Thimbleweed Park, right, which was just an absolute joy. To play, um, son of a bitch, they're throwing grenades back at us. Run! Oh, they the ah, oh, lost the guys and they blew up the box grenades. You still got two grenades, bro? Yeah, wait, I can't fuck this up. That's the problem. Oh, come on! You've only got one grenade left. It's the last building. You don't need to worry about no more buildings. I don't, but I've got to worry live. about these guys because suddenly we're in a crack shot territory where these guys can just cane you. I'm gonna throw any shit at you as well. Yeah? Well, I wasn't expecting that. Motherfucking pineapple. Oh! So good. This game is just too. I mean, the, the whole. Is it a bird? Top down and so. So we're gonna kill the enemies, destroy the builds, and activate all the switches. If I remember rightly, you didn't have to activate any switches on the late in Cannon Fodder 1. In Cannon Fodder 1, you had, when you started to get into the, like, the enemy fortress near the end... It became Switchy Town. Then you had Switch Town. But the Switch Town was more a case of, you know, open this door, close this door, activate this bridge. So you could actually get like tanks and jeeps all over the place. And then you got a helicopter and it was like, oh! See, so, uh, it, it just it kicked ass. Whoa! Ooh. You're tickling your bum hole with that, like. And there's a problem with them this throwing map shit at us. It's amazing. Oh. Oh. I'm so fucking funny. I need to get to some grenades, and I don't know where any are. I haven't been paying attention. I know there's some around here. I think they're down here. Round, round, get around. Nope, uh, not that there. looks like a minefield, if ever there was one. See, everything looks like minefields and things in this. I think it's to, like I think a... you might just have to run... Um, <sighs> I thought I lost a guy there. Push Somebody's the having pump. a bit of a jibber-jabber. He's stuck on... Oh, he's too excited. He had his coffee in the morning. Three, five, four, oh, fix. I just had my... I Wait a fix. Uh -huh. Jesus, there's loads of them. This dumbass bloody Can find the power. I'm, I'm, there we are. You see, this is the best part of it because now what I can do, I can just pitch like grenades all over the place. Whoop! Oh! Fuck up his blood <laughs> But you've got to hit these perfect. Otherwise, you can't do. Ooh. Let's get the hell out of here before I get hit with a door. And now it's time to go back and see if it blew off. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Whoa. 
Oh, he's down, man. He's down. Who got it? Oh, lost a guy. At least you've got nuts. <laughs> oh, I think nuts just got shot. No. <laughs> you still got nuts. Let's do this. Shoot the goat. Goat's down, man. The goat's down. Press the button. Wait, I can't press the button yet because I've got to kill this guy. And I know I should have just chopped off the actual squad in a uh, team. Team nuts. There we go. Right, that's everyone dead. We're heading to the switch. Yes. I've got to push the button. Come here, Phil. You've got one of your drawing pads there, haven't you? Do it. Do it now. Because it's got like a harder kind of... Hard surfaces. Yeah, that I can use. Um, and on here. Yes! What the fuck is this? It's like a tin helmet. It is. <coughs> here uh, comes the lost in service, Patrick. The lost in service. I need like you could just piece of paper. This will grip. It's got the grip. Here we go. Got one. Got one. Oh, I don't know. I thought I might have knocked something. Don't worry. We'll remember you. Johnny. Johnny the door. <laughs> <laughs> Frank the spank. Johnny. Holy shit. Something just went fucking cray cray. Right, so that was fun. Um, it looks like cannon fodder has decided to explode, and um, we're gonna have to come back to it. Looks no, we're not. We're not finished with cannon fodder two yet because I don't. We haven't shown any of the alien worlds yet. I haven't shown anything extra, and I don't want to leave it there. Mm. So you were gonna say the technical glitches waited for to at least play some of the game this time. Yeah, which is a bonus. So then it was like, uh, nope. Now is the Crazy time. Crazy time. Rug. But anyway, go on. Um, Face. We're going to come back and we are going to finish off that playthrough after I happily repair the joy of that uh, exploded Amiga. Right. We'll catch you next time. Indeed. Bye. Doodles. Thanks for watching this video. Feel free to throw us a like, subscribe, or maybe follow us on one of our social setups. Maybe even take a look at our Patreon or one of our many other videos. But for now, we hope you enjoyed this video, and we'll all see you very soon. Doodles!